Hey guys, let's say you install iOS 5 and then you went ahead and installed iTunes Beta 10.5. But then you decide, well, maybe it's not for me. Let me go ahead and downgrade iTunes back to iTunes 10.3. And I'll go ahead and downgrade my iPhone as well. Well, when you downgrade iTunes after you've used it, you'll probably get this message here. And it's a dreadful one. The file ituneslibrary.itl cannot be read because it was created by a newer version of iTunes. Would you like to download iTunes now? That's a scary message to get, especially if you have an extensively, meticulously organized iTunes library. You don't want to lose it. Well, fortunately, iTunes is generally smart enough to create a backup of your older library file for the older um, version of iTunes. So let me show you how to get that back. Just go ahead and hit quit here. Open up your finder window. And you want to go to your, your home folder and then to the music folder. All right, then you should see iTunes. So here's the file, the iTunes library file, the problem child file. We're just going to rename that to Ode. Okay. Okay. So now it's old. Now you should see a folder that says previous iTunes libraries. And this is a key because this should contain the older version of your iTunes library file, but not too old. It should be just the last saved off version prior to upgrading. So you just open that and you should also notice the date here. So iTunes library 2011 6.8. So that's pretty recent. So what you want to do is just go ahead and copy that, fo that file there. Copy that into your primary iTunes folder. And then of course you just want to rename it, take out the date, just like that, so it looks exactly like the older iTunes library file, except it doesn't have old at the end. So iTunes can use this. So now let's try opening up iTunes and see if we still get that dreaded error message. Nope, it looks like it's working. So folks, that's how you fix iTunes when you downgrade. It's that easy. Let me know if you have any questions. This is Jeff with jailbreakmovies.com.